In this video, we're going to look at removing duplicates. Uh, before we go out and just flat out remove a duplicate, it might be nice to see what duplicates we might have. We'll use conditional formatting to get started here. So I'm concerned I have a duplicate entry here on the employee ID. After I make my selection of values, I'll click on conditional formatting, highlight cell rules, duplicate values. Perfect. So what happens then is it just automatically gives me a duplicate in if we have any in dark red text there. So I'll choose OK. Let's look at that one more time here. Let me select everybody's last names. Conditional formatting highlight cell rules. Duplicate values. Perfect. Nice little trick that I like to do is I like to add it to the quick access toolbar. So if you ever find a favorite tool that you're going to use quite frequently, you can right click it and then do the add to quick access toolbar. I'm going to select my dates here. Now I can find it up here on my quick access toolbar, the duplicate values. All right, so I've got a confirmation here that we have a duplicate record here, no doubt. So it's kind of nice to see it ahead of time. Now, ultimately, I want to get rid of that. So I can click my active cell on any of these cells here, proceed to the Data tab, and choose the Remove Duplicates. Okay, I want to keep them all highlighted here so it measures each value against each column. My data has headers. I'm all set here. I'll hit OK and uh, boom, it zapped out. It would have zapped out the lower one of the duplicate values. It keeps, oh, it's always going to keep the top one from the values it finds. So I proceed with OK. The conditional formatting has been taken off. It's still there, but now that we don't have any duplicate values, it's still there. If I would like to make a confirmation that I have duplicate values still heading on, I can go to the find and select actually and look for cells that contain conditional formatting. All of these here would be. So if we type over top of this a duplicate, we will get that uh, red cell highlight. Let's just go ahead and verify that real quick here. I'm going to use the, the keyboard shortcut here to copy what's directly above. As you can see here, um, a control a control quote that is sorry uh, that will create the duplicate value above so there we have it remove duplicates show duplicates in conditional formatting